hang on. Okay, I am confused. Wait, holy crap. Holy crap. Dude, no. He's mine now. Hello everyone, welcome back to the Volkus YouTube channel. Before we get started with the main focus of today's video, I've got a few little things to cover first. Uh, the podcast, my podcast, The Tavern Talk, has officially been delayed. As I said, if it wasn't up by Wednesday, then I would delay it. That didn't work, obviously. So expect that at some point in the future. I mean, obviously, hopefully soon, but no more official release date is going to be confirmed now. Secondly, the... Um, uh, right, yeah, the Covenant video. That will be coming out next week, hopefully early next week. So... Again, I have my reasons as to why that's taking some time. And finally, before the main focus of today's video, I would like to show off my two th uh, additional purchases I made today. I've, I've been out, uh, which is where I got my packs. But also, I bought this, the Fallout 4 Game of the Year edition, for £2, because uh, basically I'm taking a chance on the um, codes for the DLCs and stuff working because I already have the game but it also comes with a nice looking disc and the code of course uh, I do pretty much I pretty much have decided that unless there's some incredible exception say if Elder Scrolls 6 was incredibly good I probably won't ever buy a Bethesda game again because of Fallout 76. But considering Fallout 4 came out before 76, I'm classing any game that came out before 76 as not the same thing. So, you know, like um, Fallout 4, 3, Skyrim, Oblivion, whatever, those are exempt from my um, basically non purchasing because fuck Bethesda fuck what they've done with 76 especially recently they uh, go check out Yong Ye's channel because he's a really good uh, source of news and updates on this uh, basically Bethesda have just recently banned somebody for reporting bugs to them so this guy is a really dedicated Fallout 76 player who really helps the community by providing bug fixes and support as well as custom maps but Bethesda banned him because he utilised a bug for the sole purpose of reporting it to them, which he then did. And after he reported it to them, Bethesda said, Oh, so you reported this bug for us to fix because we're too lazy to do it ourselves? Fuck you. You used the bug, so you're banned. So he's now quit Fallout 76, and I 100% support his decision. And yeah, I think everyone should boycott Fallout 76 and not buy a Bethesda game ever again, because fuck them. Uh, okay, a bit of a tangent there, I'll be honest. Uh, let's just get this out of the way. This is my second thing today. The Injustice 2 Steel Box. Finally got my hands on one. I've been wanting it for some time because I'm a really big fan of Injustice 2. I've been playing it for pretty much ever since it came out and I'm going to continue playing it a lot. But uh, my main two reasons for getting this were for the Steel Box and for a copy of the game on disc which I am going to lend to my friend because his game has been really fucked up recently and hopefully if he gets it on disc instead of digital it could help, I don't know, but uh, it does come with some just little leaflets, pamphlets and a little ad for Wonder Woman which is kind of weird, but alright so let's get on to the main thing finally uh, here today we have five packs for me to open for your amusement Two of which are the Forbidden Light packs, and three of which are the brand new Cosmic Eclipse. Uh, so these have some really nice pack arts. This one we've got um, Igly Buff, Togepi, and how the hell have I forgotten what that fake one's called? Clefer, there we go. Uh, on this pack we've got two of my favourite Pokemon of all time, Time and Space. Didn't mean to make that pun, whatever the hell you call that, Dialga and Palkia. And finally, you've got my boy Solgaleo and also Lunala on this pack. I uh, just want to apologise for pronouncing it as Solgalgio in some of my old videos. Uh, I cringe now when I look back on that. I don't know why I didn't notice there wasn't a second G in that name. But anyway, these are my packs. So I think we're going to crack open the Forbidden Light ones first. 
Uh, okay, so obviously the Sun and Moon pack trick, if you don't know what that is, basically it used to be three off the back um, and then you put them the next two behind them because that means that you open the rare of the pack last. Sun and Moon, it's now four cards because they've started putting an energy in every pack, which I like, but it means you have to change the trick. So. Uh, okay, so obviously take the code card off and then the next four cards uh, off the back like so, put the next two behind them and then put the whole thing on the back of your little pile. So let's get started. So we've got Esper first card for today. We got Krogunk, Froakie, Cubone, Snova. I really like Snova. Uh, our energy is the fire energy. Okay, we got Bonnie, uh, one of our trainers, Metal Frying Pan, and Mysterious Treasure. The reverse is a nice reverse rare, Barbacle, and our rare is a regular rare Heatran. So I'm actually more chuffed with the Barbacle Reverse out of that pack. So not a bad first pack, to be honest, not at all. I'm just gonna rearrange my camera, give me a second. All right, we are back. I uh, just wanted to make sure that my camera was sufficient to see the cards properly. So this is our second Forbidden Light pack. So here we go, we've got Gumi, Furfu, Helioptile, uh, Hon Honage, <laughs> misread that one. Uh, we've got Quancha, uh, we've got the Ultra Recon Squad Supporter card, Diggers B, and our final uncommon is the fossil evacuation map. Our energy is the steel energy. We have a we have another reverse rare, that's two for two. That's pretty good, Pangoro. And the rare is a regular rare Obama Snow. So again we got a reverse rare taking precedence over the regular rare in that pack. Okay, so not too bad for only two packs. I mean, we did get two reverse rares. Nothing interesting, though, apart from that. So we will move on now to the main three packs uh, that I got today. Those two were basically just extras, um, but I decided I didn't want all Cosmic Eclipse. So I think we'll start with this pack art, because as much as I like it, it's probably my least favourite of the three. Not, not to offend any uh, Iggly Buff or Togepi or Cleffa fans, I like I like those as well. It's just, uh, I guess I'm less into cute and cuddly when it comes to Pokemon. So, card trick once again. Next two behind, and we will proceed with the pack. So, we've got Ducklet, Swirlix, Alolan Grimer, uh, Slugma, um, Chinchu, a Grass Energy, Beastite, never seen that card before. Uh, we got a Lily. I haven't had a Lily in quite a while. That's kind of nostalgic. Hey, we got a Jolteon. I love Jolteon. That's pretty cool. We got. I thought that was another reverse rare. Then we've got a Heracross with um, pretty cool looking art and the rare. We've got a regular rare, but for a regular rare, it's pretty badass. We've got Kyogre. So, I'll take that for a regular rare, to be honest. Kyogre is one of my favourite Pokemon. I do prefer Groudon, to be fair, but 
Groudon is Groudon. Kyogre is still a colossal badass. Last two packs now. Hopefully we do actually pull something. I would kind of expect at least a nice hollow pull or some kind of ultra rare out of five packs. I don't know if that's me being greedy or what, but I, it's just from past experience. I do usually get something out of at least four or five packs. Definitely not every time, but, you know, sometime. I mean, ten packs are, I think, often known to be better, but often out of tens I will at least get one ultra rare. It's not very common that I don't, so I kind of hope, uh, I am really hoping out of these, because I've never actually had any team up GX before, in any sort, any sort, not even a promo from a box or tin or something, so uh, it would be pretty cool if these packs could give me my first ever team up card, especially since some of the ones from this new set are freaking amazing, and I would absolutely love to get my hands on almost any of them, to be honest, so... Yeah, I think we've done that right. So, second last pack now. Come on, um, come on, packs. Be nice to me, please. So we're opening up with an Alolan Sandshrew. Always did like that one. Snorrent. Uh, coughing. Uh, Drillber. Swirlix. Water energy this time. Got a Moil. Flareon, that's two evolutions. Really love evolutions. Maybe this will give me good luck for the pack. And an Igly buff. Oh, come on, that's one of the pack arts. That means I've got to get something good, right? Oh, and Alolan Vulpix. That's a really, that's probably my favourite Alolan Pokemon. So come on, come on, come on. We've got it. We've got something. Yes! Look at that absolute legendary pull there. That is awesome. Yes, I got my first team up card. I'm literally trying to figure out how to pronounce that name. Is that Naganadel and Guzzlord? Ultra Beast Tag Team, that is awesome. Really, really good card right there. 280 HP. Damn. That's actually a really good ability it's got there. This is a great card. Yes. That's awesome. Really, really pleased about that. But I doubt I'm going to get anything as good as that from the last pack. But that is awesome. I'm really, really happy about that. Finally, got my hands on a tag team. Awesome. Okay, final pack, which is my favorite pack art. So maybe that'll give me good luck again. But hey, I'm not too fussed now if I don't get anything else. Because we just got a tag team for the first time. And that's really, really cool. Okay, if I can get this stupid pack open. There we go. So yeah, guys, if you if you enjoyed this video or my, any of my Pokemon videos and want to do more of that kind of content, do let me know in the comments below. Anything you comment, I will read because, you know, I don't get many comments. I'm still a small YouTuber, so if you do comment something, chances are I will read it. And okay, so final pack here, we've got Cosmog, Pantrum, Drillbur again, Tangela, Eevee, Psychic Energy, uh, oh yeah, Tag Team Trainer card, Beleba, Belieber, and Bright, Be Belieber, Belalba, Belieber, Jesus Christ, and Bryson Man, very bizarre, but you know. At least it's not Believer. Fucking like Pangoro. Rapidash. Gotta love Rapidash. What the hell? I think I might have screwed up the card trick there, but what. What am I looking at? I'm really confused right now. Hang on. Okay, I am confused. Wait, holy crap. Holy crap. Dude, no. I've literally just pulled a secret rare. Are you serious? What the? What the fuck? What? Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh god, okay. 
no way. No way. I can't believe I just pulled that card, man. Oh, what? Oh my god. I am I am, I am kind of on a bit of a high now from that. Look at this baby. Steelix Secret Rare. Uh, in case you don't know what a secret rare is, basically, if the numbers on the bottom here, you've got the number of the cards total in the set, and you've got the number that this card is. So this card, uh, this set has 236 cards in the non-secret part of the set, and this says 247 out of 236. So that means it is a secret rare, and honestly... Obviously you can't see mask but I'm freaking happy right now they I'll tell you something they always get you when you least expect it because I f actually accidentally felt this card and I thought oh that's a regular rare I have to end it on a regular rare yeah no <laughs> Pokemon decided to throw a curveball and I couldn't be more grateful to be honest Well, that was a pretty damn good way to end this. I mean... These packs... Got a secret rare... And a Tag Team GX. Okay, that is awesome. Well, that's definitely a good way to get back into buying packs again. <laughs> I am getting more of that set, and that is the second time now that my first ever packs from a set have yielded a secret rare before. I mean, what? <laughs> so, thank you everyone for watching. If you did enjoy the pulls and stuff, as I said, drop a like down below, let me know, and put a comment as well. And I should be uploading some more content as soon as possible. <laughs> Not much more to say really, I'm kind of uh, kind of lost for words at the secret rare, so thank you for watching, check out my friends and shit in the future channels, whatever. <laughs> secret rare, secret rare, secret rare, secret rare, secret rare, secret rare. I will see you in the next video, maybe more Pokemon stuff, soon. Bye.